Ball, Biggie Boy is here, folks. Jarzinho Rosenstrike, the first native of Suriname to compete in the UFC. Decorated kickboxing career, but really took his training to that requisite next level when he signed that UFC contract. He said, essentially, instead of training twice a day, I'm now training three times a day, and his UFC results certainly speak to that commitment. Undefeated, calling out guys like Francis Ngannou, not a lot of people burning up Nick Maynard's phone asking to fight the Predator. That's Rosenstrike in a nutshell. We'll see if he can get the power going early. Oh, oh, So with much fanfare, here is John Jones back in defense of his UFC Heavyweight Championship. Remarkable the manner in which he came back from a three-year layoff. Figures to present an even better version here tonight. Well, so many people questioned or wondered when John Jones would come to heavyweight. When he did, he looked better than he ever has inside the UFC's octagon. Winning the Heavyweight Championship and reasserting himself as the dominant force in mixed martial arts. John Jones once again steps into the octagon looking to build on his legacy. And we don't know how long for this game John Jones is, so enjoy him while he is here. We'll see how it goes tonight in this UFC Heavyweight Championship title defense. John Jones steps inside the octagon. He's ready to fight. Tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. And now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. If it was the first. Fighting out of the blue corner. Presenting the challenger. Yes, in your biggie boy, Rosenstrike. And now, introducing the champion. Fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending USC. Heard B, he will handle the action inside the octagon. All right, so we get another look at John Bones Jones here tonight. He immediately takes the center of the octagon. We'll see if he goes to the shot. Turn his entire body into that uppercut, and it landed exactly as he was hoping for. Oh! Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Jones gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. That's a big hook. These boys are standing right in front of each other. Just kind of going at it. Well, he's landed a few big uppercuts already. I will bet you $1,000 he sets it up again. You're not taking my money, J.A. That uppercut is coming. And when it lands, it's going to land and land very damaging. Jones is bleeding from the mouth now. A cut there on his lip. That doesn't look like fun. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, nice right hand by the champ. Yeah. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. 
clinch position. Look for the opponent to try to circle off of the cage. Oh, Just trying to get some extra. Oh, he hurt him again. Well, why fix what's not broken? Why not go right back to that overhand? He's hurt. Oh, nice right in. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss. Now he's back up. Down defense holds up. Nice up. Oh. Great job moving yes. into his opponent and getting to that single oh. That'll do it! Oh, stop, stop. Ricky Boy, John Cena gets out of Holy smokes. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, two seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Yazid Yazid.